Hello and welcome to my ever first tutorial on how to create a Photoshop style icon in Photoshop CS4. This is the final thing that we will be working towards. Right, okay, let's begin. To start off with, go to File, New and set your document width to 100 pixels and your height to 100 pixels and press OK. You then need to change this background color in the palette to 2F64 A8 and press OK. Now to load this onto the background you must press Alt Backspace Alt Alt backspace for that and then you then need to create a new layer above and fill this one with a light grey colour which is 808080 and press OK and then do the same for that Alt backspace and then what you need to do is you need to go into blending options on that layer and set it to overlay that all still so you can still see the blue and then you need to select this layer and go to filter render lighting effects and change this so that the light is coming from the top as you can see there like that and press OK and now that's giving you that sort of nice sort of light effect at the top and now the fun part which is putting the text on now for this example I'm just going to put the letters I and T one in lowercase and one in uppercase and then if we just move those slightly more to the middle there and uh, change the text color to a black and then what you need to do is you need to go to control A to select all of them and go to this text there and you need to align center and so that way you've got it in the middle and then you need to add the effects to the text. So if you go back into blending options again and go to inner shadow and you need this set to multiply as it is at the moment, we need an opacity of 53%, an, ang an angle of 108, and a distance of 2 leave that as zero and then another distance of two so there you've got your inner shadow and then you need your bevel and emboss and if you set this to outer bevel and you need your depth set to one percent and size to one pixel and soften to one pixel and then you leave this angular to 108 and change this opacity to 18 and this opacity to 8% and then press OK and this and this basically gives you a very nice effect which you can use for anything else and I will post in the description colors for the other logos such as Flash and Illustrator so thank you and I hope you enjoyed my first tutorial